Happy Saturday, everybody. This is a pick a card reading for today, June 10th, Saturday. You pick a card, it's your main energy, but I pull them all together for all of us. And if you're born today, June 10th, babies, I will do a reading for you next. If you pick card number one, you have the Eight of Pentacles. Okay, Eight of Pentacles. Well, something is a, a work in progress. I do feel some of you, you may be um, offered to travel for work and you will receive extra bonus or money because of it. That is for someone out there. Um, there is something about travel here. Okay. And, um, your hard work and per perseverance is going to pay off, but you still have to work, work on, um, a project or on a goal. Um, this is a new emotional beginning. I feel um, some of you are going to be very happy at, at your, res uh, your the results that are going to come in. This is also money addition too, so I do feel that energy as well. If you pick card number two, you have the seven of wands. You are not giving up. You are definitely making adjustments and you're pushing through. You're standing your ground. Now, I do feel that for some of you, you could be a little bit stressed or worried today or, um, or you're just kind of like overthinking things. Maybe you got a headache. Maybe you didn't sleep well. I don't know. I'm picking up that energy, but you're persevering. All right. What I feel here, stay the course. You are on the right path and new opportunities are coming through. I also feel here that life, your life, all in general, your um, life-driven purpose and journey is showing up here. Life is an expression of you. Life is more than existing, okay? So just know that and move forward because you are definitely on the uh, right path. So stay the course. You are moving in the right direction and new opportunities are opening up. Card number three is the major arcana of the full. Important day for you. It's a major arcana. Um, I do feel that for some of you, you may not even speak to someone anymore. You're more to yourself. You're a perfectionist and you're like, I don't care anymore. Um, so you're moving forward. Something will be revealed. Valuable information. Maybe a secret comes through and you're kind of pushing forward. This is adventurous energy, a strong new beginning. So I do like that energy. Okay. Now, when we're looking at everything, I do feel today, um, for some of us in the next couple weeks, I feel um, there's going to be a lot of either get togethers, partnerships being formed, speaking from, um, um, speaking to someone, heart to heart communications are definitely coming through new beginnings with communication secrets exposed is what I'm feeling or truths re revealed. Um, new beginnings definitely are showing up here too and bright new ideas and epiphanies. Um, we need to relax. We need to also know that we're going to get what we want. Okay maybe with a delay. Um, opportunities are abound, but there is some jealousy around, okay? Jealousy does surround us and competitive energy. Um, keep looking at the bigger picture because we are drawing in energy as, as well and manifesting. It's important to ask, what does your heart want, okay? Be free to manifest your heart desires. That is what you should be manifesting. Now, we need to dissolve attachments of the past, so there is something here. It no longer holds power over us. So we need to kind of let it go and move forward. Okay. So that is the reading for today, June 10th, Saturday. Have a fabulous Saturday. Happy birthday if you're born today, June 10th. This is a quick and general reading. This is your soul or your theme. And that is your wish card. And your soul or your theme is the Ace of Wands. So to me, this is definitely a new journey, a new beginning, a new idea, a new job, a new home, a new something new definitely is showing up here. For some of you, this is destined to happen. It is uh, karmic as well. Um, I do feel that you may be released from some kind of hold or some kind of opinion. Your um, reputation or the way people viewed you is going to change. Okay, don't assume things without knowing the facts and figures. So there's going to be some kind of rebirth and creates a strong new beginning here. I definitely love this, okay? Um, if you've been lonely or something's been a void, that is ending. There is a lot of flirtatious and romantic energies around you too. Um, I do feel that. I do feel you're going to be making some lifestyle adjustments this year too. Patience and tolerance is going to be important. You may be dealing with a Sagittarius energy as well. And your creativity is going to keep bringing and inspiring you. Um, I do feel you will have some total victory during your solar year. 
there will be some kind of either continuance, uh, a continuation or something could be, um, something needs to be rehashed or done or court and there could be a continuance. But I do feel for some of you, there's going to be a major separation from someone or something too. You got major, big, big changes coming in, which are, which are leading to strong new beginnings. And there's going to be some intensity in your love life for sure. Um, stay strong, be the guiding light, ground yourself with love this year too. So it's very important. Dream big because I do see, um, dream, dreaming with your heart will bring a lot to you. Okay. All right. Now your wish for your solar year is the two of wands. I do feel there's an, a decision to make and it's got to do with either a contract or love for some reason. Okay. So I'm definitely picking up that energy and it's a strong it's a strong maybe to a yes, okay? Um, the important numbers for your solar year, 14, 38, 27, 9, 52, 72, 4, um, 11, 12, 39, 26. Wow, a lot of numbers. <laughs> I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful birthday and a blessed solar year ahead and beyond. Everyone else, a fabulous Saturday. Bye for now.